Okay, we are going to do this a little bit different. We're going to do this with a, um, a view of just my hands. Uh, the last time that I done it where we looked at my face, I had people say that they couldn't see the jewelry. So we're going to try this like this. And we've got a little angel pin. This came out of a $7.99 jar that I had 20% off on. And, uh, see if I just lay it down there. If it'll focus in on it. There we go. So, anyhow, and I'm going to try to just move it a little bit. There we go. Anyway, when I put my hands next to it, it tends to focus. So, just a little angel pen. This is a pretty little Lucite bangle. Uh, it's kind of a yellowy, goldy color. And I don't think it's old. It has no marks or anything in it. Napkin rings. So not jewelry. Anyway. Let's see. No, I've done picked up something. I don't know what it is. On the cloth. Uh, a turquoise colored cheap earring. A tie bar and looking for my there's no name on it, so I'm just gonna lay it out though so you can see it. And it's a nice silver tone tie bar. Or a collar stay bar, maybe. There we go. Yeah. That's cute. Uh, see, no name on the back of it. Maybe. There may be a name. Nope, no name. It's a uh, gold tone brooch. Looks like that. These are a nice pair of cufflinks. Very, very nice. Very nice. Let's see if I can get them. And this, all this stuff came, she said it came out of, off the floor. And, uh, so. Anyway. I don't see no name on it. On that one. Or on that one. But they're really nice. Go tone. Uh, like that. Let's see if I can get that to do that. that. Very nice. I gotta cut them with my finger. Very pretty. Let's see. Little. Flower. Let's see, no name. Pin back tie clip, pin back, whatever you want to call it. These are really nice. And I'm hoping they have a name on them. We shall see. Don't see anything in there. Don't see anything there. Love knot, silver tone. Love knot tie clip, uh, cuff link. And there is a pair. It's pretty. Uh, enamel heart pendant on a really gross thing. That's pretty. Uh, looks like Mother Mary and Baby Jesus. That's what it looks like to me. Let's see. Come on. You can focus. There you go. Okay. <coughs> Little tie, tie pin, tie tack, pin back says attitude. A 
bangle wrapped with thread and it's glued there I don't know if it's homemade or if it comes factory made like that do not know another pair of type of tie clips of uh, oh those are two different ones uh, this one has an M on it Let's see if it'll focus there we go M. It's a monogram with an M. And then this one is just like that. And I'm going to lay them to the side and hope I find the match. Uh, I don't know what this is. I think Captain America. It's a watch. Captain America watch, I believe. Anyway. Ooh. Those are pretty. Very, very pretty. These are um, barrette. No, well, they're not really barrettes, but they're fastened to a bobby pin. They've been fastened to a bobby pin. They're really pretty. No missing. Oops, there's a missing stone right there. It's the only one. Two. Oh, there's two. Right side by side on that one missing. So they could be repaired. There's another one of those stupid napkin rings. Like it belongs. Another plastic Lucite bra bracelet. Not the, not vintage Lucite for sure. A watch band without the watch that snaps in it. A watch that is says Elcon. Let's see. Okay, guys. You gotta focus. Focus. Focus, focus. There it is. And it is a bangle style band watch. Ooh, that's pretty. Huh. I don't see no signature on the back of it. And you're saying, what's pretty, Cindy? What? So, I'm not used to doing this format. So, it's a Christmas tree swirlies with rhinestones. I don't see any missing rhinestones. Mm, there might be one missing there. Actually, those there are not rhinestones. They're painted in. Yeah, there's, no, there's something in that. So, it's painted in. So, Okay. Uh, really nice swirly silk gold tone brooch. Another really nice swirly gold tone brooch. And let's see. And look to see if that was signed. No, that one's not signed. This one is signed. And it says. Yeah. Good luck with what it says. <clears throat> no clue. Anyway. A little pearl there. The glue. Somebody glued it in with that gross glue that you know that I hate. And here is, let's see if I can get it to show you what that okay, it was a dollar ninety nine. Trying to see if I can get it to show you what that signature was. I don't think so. If you can see that, you tell me. I can't see it. Even looking at it. Oh. Well, that's nice. Let's see what that says. It says something on it that might be very interesting for us to read. It also says $1.99 on it, but let's see what it says. It says Anson and then the patent number. And it is a money clip. A golf themed money clip come on why don't you want to focus you just don't like to play you like to focus on faces don't you wow there you go golf I don't know what that says I don't think it says anything anyway Ooh, that's pretty. 
Oh, it's missing. It's missing its little fastener where it fastens on. But look, isn't it pretty, little butterflies? Uh, the color's not going to be good. They're light pink and real pale mint green there. Okay. Really cute. Fun angel tack pen. Let's lay it there. A angel button cover. Oh, isn't that cute? A little tennis girl, and there is a mark on it. And yeah, whatever. Almost looks like China, but I can't see. Okay, there we go. So she's holding a little tennis racket. Her little face is a pearl. She's cute. Mardi Gras beads. You know that I don't like Mardi Gras beads. Don't we? <laughs> Somebody's being testy. A little heart charm. And let's see. Come on. There you go. Little heart. I mean, I said heart cross. Cross charm. Let's see. Wow. Yeah. Some little dingle dangles. Hmm. Oh, that's a cute little hat. Oh, I bet this is. I don't know what this is. Anyway, it doesn't have a signature, but it's really cute. Little, little hat brooch. Uh. That's sweet. Uh, a watch. A watch, a watch, a watch. That says... Circa. C-I-R-C-I. C-I-R-C-A. And it has angels on it. This must have been the angel light. see no signature on that is an acorn and an oak leaf a little acorn up here and then rhinestone and the oak leaf come on come on just don't want to focus okay just lay you down there maybe you'll focus there okay a little not stretchy bracelet that says I don't know what it says oh I do it says Cookie Lee and it's supposed to be stretchy but it's really tight anyway it's a little people's children's children I do know that that is not a plural word so there's the other one of those the two of those oops the two of those another watch that says nothing that is a fashion piece and not even a nice fashion piece okay these were interesting to me they're marked $2.99 there's a whole bunch of them and let's see was that something written inside of that almost look like one of them had something written inside of it mm. If it did, it was just a maker's mark because they're as magnetic as can be. So, yeah, they're nice. Nice bangles. 
comb. I'm going to just lay those there. And I'm going to pick all this other stuff up because it's had time to focus for you to see it. I'm going to do my thing here. I'm still holding on to that because I'm, I'm waiting on a match for it. So I'll leave those there. Oh, yeah. A little rhinestone. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what it is. What is it? Does anybody know what it is? I don't know what it is. Do you know what it is? Tell me if you know. I don't know. And this is a little, <laughs> little, yeah. So, move those out of the way. Okay, this is a whole bunch of little tack pins. You've got the green ribbon, a, a liberty bell, and an angel. Let's see if it'll focus for me. There we go. Just a little bit better. Okay, not great. But, okay. Maybe it'll focus some clip-on earrings with a what looks to be a lion's head in them uh, no signature yeah, no signature very very lightweight very costumey so a huge beaded gemstone bangle and then there's another one and okay that's the back to a tie clip. This is a ring that's missing some little stones. It's a little adjustable uh, cross ring. And it's totally adjustable, but it's missing some stones. So, another watch that is broken that says Pugo. Pugo. So, it just looks like the, that maybe it's missing a pin. Not sure. Let me show you. Very bright, yellowy, gold looking. So, we'll lay it out like that. A rosary. Actually, two rosaries. Two blue and white beaded rosaries. there. Hmm, that's pretty. That's real pretty. It has a signature. Let's see if we can read it. I can't read nothing today. Uh, it does... Oh, it says Jerry's. So, it's enamel with pearls. As I show things, I'm moving them away. So, that's pretty. Um, some beaded bracelets. Three beaded bracelets. And nothing spectacular. Oh, now there are some beads. And it would appear that, um, that somewhere in it is either something's broken or they came from something else because I kept seeing little white ones. So this is twisted gold and um, white sea beads and probably right in there maybe some of the broken. And I'm starting again. I'll have to splice these together. Um, I accidentally hit the button that knocked it off. Okay, these are pretty. Well, these have an interesting back. They're just a little button earring, a little white button earring. Let's see if it's going to, yeah, there. It finally focused in. The lot is wrong for some reason. Anyway, here's some more of those beaded gemstones. And this is a nice bracelet. It doesn't have any kind of signature in it. 
but it is nice. Uh, it's a woven, it's a bangle with a woven uh, thing on the outside of it. Uh, two pairs of earrings, little studs, a stretch NASCAR, uh, well, race car bracelet. It's got the car and it's got flags and number eight, which is, um, isn't that Dale Earnhardt or Dale Jr.? Uh, ooh, those are cool. Some old Lucite looking bangles. Cheapies, but they're cool. So, very neat. And we're about to the bottom of the jar. So, okay. Oh, that's a pretty, pretty. A dove with a heart, and it says the Variety Club. It's a brooch. Let's see. It says the Variety Club on the back of it. It's a pretty brooch. That's just a amethyst rock. There's another one of those. Another one of those. Bunny bell. A bunny bell. And I bet those were originally on an earring. I just bet you money. So. And. Let me get all the rest of that out. Well, there's a. Great old big rhinestone, but whatever it came out of, I have no clue. So, anyway. So, there's the other bunny bell. Uh, a little vase rhinestone brooch. A scatter pen. Looks like a little dini jar. A little heart scatter pen, and it is missing some rhinestones. I can see that. And I don't see any signature on either one of those. Um, that, a bead. This must be something to do with the other thing that I pulled out. And it has a number on it. No clue. Uh, a um, patriotic heart tack pen. That says something on the back of it. Uh, made in the USA. Avon. And a little angel pen that has a little green rhinestone and it's got something broke off of it. So whatever the angel was holding is broke. So not a great haul. Not a great haul at all. I had great hopes for this one but not too awesome. So I love the rock though. So Anyway, I'm glad I didn't spend much more than $7 for it, so it'll help fill out up, up a jewelry jar. So, anyway, I uh, did not find the other one of those, so that's disappointing. I have three napkin rings. Yeah, three napkin rings. So, and an, an earring that's not matched. And I got a plastic rhinestone. So, thank you for watching. Y'all have a wonderful day. Bye.